Noodle, what do you think about the new Sky Striker card? Same. I don't know. I feel the same, Noodle. What's going on, guys? Pegasus from the Wise Guys. Appreciate you guys for tuning in. We're here to talk about Aileron. It's a new Sky Striker card that just got revealed. The card is terrible, but let's talk about it. The card says it is always treated as a Sky Striker card, and it says a Sky Striker Ace monster equipped with this card gains 400 attack. You can only use one of the following effects of Aileron once per turn. That's terrible already. During the main phase, you can target one Sky Striker Ace monster you control. Equip this card from your hand or field to that target. If this card on the field is destroyed, you can send one Sky Striker spell from your deck to the graveyard. Now, why is this bad? Let's talk about it. The first glaring issue that I see is it is not a Sky Striker Ace monster. Therefore, the monster by itself cannot turn into a Link monster. Therefore, if you wanted to one for one this out and try to do something cheeky like that, well, no, it's just not going to work like that. Second of all, I also feel that the portion that says you can only use one of the following effects of Aileron once per turn and only once per turn is awful because you're trying to equip it to basically be a pseudo foolish burial goods. And because you're doing that on a slow one turn by turn basis and having to destroy it basically on your opponent's turn, that's a terrible card. It's just not good at all. If you compare it to what we have right now, basically with Foolish Burial Goods, the Brave Token stuff, a lot of the DPE stuff, there's just absolutely no point to play a card like this. And with other cards like the Quick Play Linkage coming out, as well as HAMP, whatever the H-A-M-P stands for, there really is no space for this card, to be honest. Now, if it was a Sky Striker Ace monster, then you'd be talking about something because you, then you'd have a 500 or below machine that you could machine dupe spells would be into the grave and then one for one would also be a target that you could obviously mix in not to keep going on and on about some of the uh, issues but i'm going to continue to go on about them the other issue that i also see is that any card that could actually interact with the card on a follow-up very slow ass turn would send the card anyway and this card is required to be destroyed just to remind you as we load that onto the screen and area zero says send multi-roll says sin and basically you would ask yourself why would i play this card over a card like foolish burial goods or why would i ever engage search this those are all the issues with the card maybe we could find something positive the positive that i possibly see is that the mechanic when something is equipped and then is completely taken off of the field it is considered destroyed so maybe in a very slow 2005 version of something that could actually be a combo as far as pace is concerned maybe the card is good guys what do you think about this terrible card down in the comments i'm not trying to influence you i just don't see any way that this card will be relevant but let me know what you think about the card down in the comments appreciate you guys for tuning in i'm out clothing line website coming soon pegasus out arrivederci ciao